European nations sent firefighting teams to help France tackle a monster wildfire, while forest blazes also raged in Spain and Portugal and the head of the European Space Agency urged immediate action to combat climate change. More than 1,000 firefighters, backed by water bombing planes, battled for a third day of fire that has forced thousands from their homes and scorched thousands of hectares of forest in France's southwestern Gironde region. Heat waves, floods and crumbling glaciers in recent weeks have heightened concerns over climate change and the increasing frequency and intensity of extreme weather across the globe. Severe drought is set to slash the European Union's maize harvest by 15%. Dropping it to a 15 year low, just as Europeans contend with higher food prices as a result of lower than normal grain exports from Russia and Ukraine. In Portugal, more than 1,500 firefighters spent a sixth day fighting a wildfire in the central Kivlha region that has burned 10,500 hectares, including parts of the Cerro do Estela National Park. In Spain, Electrical storms triggered new wildfires and hundreds of people were evacuated from the path of one blaze in the province of Casuiers. Macron's office said extra firefighting aircraft were arriving from Greece and Sweden, while Germany, Austria, Romania and Poland were all deploying firefighters to help tackle wildfires in France. European Solidarity at Work Macron tweeted Britain's Met Office issued a four-day extreme heat warning for parts of England and Wales, 